be. I'm just a greedy son of a bitch. And I'm like, fuck me, mate. <laughs> uh, no, you're nuts. Uh, Jeremy Stenberg, for those of you that don't know, which uh, he's the guy that uh, wins a lot of X Games gold medals. He's got tattoos all over his head, face. He's also uh, done some of the craziest shit for years at a time and had some of the biggest falls and is alive to talk about some of that shit here today. Uh, so basically, dog, let's take it back. How'd you get started in freestyle motocross? My pops would just take me riding. Every day I'd go from school, he'd have the bikes loaded up, or he would pick me up from school <laughs> in his riding gear with the bikes in the back of the truck and say I had a dentist appointment. Oh. So I'd come into the office and start cracking up because he's wearing his riding gear. So yeah. I go, I got a doctor's appointment. I'm oh, like, yeah. this motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> 2000 X Games step up, bronze. 2004 triple crown champ again. 2004 X Fighters second, which is huge. You get invited to the Red Bull X Fighters, and there's only 10 of you there. It's the best 10 in the fucking world. I mean, and to get second, it was, that was a, a six series stop. You know what I mean? 2005 Action Sports Pro Tour Toyota Challenge. First, imagine that. Two, do, uh, do Action Sports Pro Tour FMX. Um, oh, yeah, second overall points. 2005 X Games Best Trick. 2006 X Games Best Trick. Gold. Uh, ESPN uh, Moto X Championships. Uh, silver. Um, ESPN. I mean, this fucking goes on, bro. It's just uh, put it this way. First, second, first, second, first, second, champ. First, <laughs> second, first, second, first, second, champ. That's how it goes. Um, and, you're, and, and so now, now you've kind of stepped back. you got all these fucking hunger dudes out there. And I noticed you, you, you took a step back. You're raising a family, beautiful family, and, um, and you're riding what you want to ride. Yeah, I figure I went through eight years of busting my ass, like day in, day out, riding every single day, even when I didn't want to ride, make myself ride. And I think the best part was just riding with my competition every day. It was me and Nate Adams. We, and when, when he would win, I would get second. Mm. Pissed me off the next week, I would win, he would get second. Now, did you guys train together? Yeah, we rode together every day. So it was like we knew what, we, what each other had. So at the end of the day, it was like I think we just helped evolve the sport because every day we were trying to learn something different just to beat each other. <laughs> hey, let's talk, about, um, let's talk about those falls. Yeah, I've had some good ones. Let's talk about the fall. And I wasn't there, but let's talk about your fall. Um, at Dutor, when you did a backflip on a wall, oh, Franny, six. and went about 40 foot, 50 foot in the air, fuck. rolling down the windows all the way to the ground. What the fuck was that like? I fucking grabbed a handful of throttle. I came up and I was just all, pop, 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 pop. and when Move I leaned up. back, I leaned back and it pulled the throttle and it gassed it all the way. Like just, and it just flung my bike so Hit power quick. band? Yeah. And just flipped my bike as fast as I've never. I've never at the point not knowing where the fuck I was in my rotation. As soon as I spun, I'm like, I have oh. no clue where the fuck I am. Like, I need to get away from a bike. And when I pushed off my bike, I thought I was pushing myself down, but I pushed myself up even higher. Oh, So I was man. like, they said I was like three or four stories high in the air. Did you know where the ground was? Did all you see is sky? As soon as I let go of the bike, I seen the ground and because I was face first, obviously. I was like coming down head first and I was just cat scratching, just trying to trying get to, to get, my feet. Yeah. I'm like, just get to my feet. Just get to my feet. You know how it is when you crash on a bike. Not like when, that. When you have time to think, you're like, fuck, this is going to hurt. Fuck, this is going to hurt. Not that much time. Fuck, this you, is going to hurt. You like 50 fucking feet. Yeah, it was gnarly. Like, I was like, fuck, I'm going to get, I'm weeded right now, you know? So how did you try to take the impact? Straight to my feet. Just, All just, I tried to do is just get to my feet. I'm like, I don't feet. fuck it. I, and they I, just shattered. Yeah, I uh, compounded my tib fib. Like the whole uh, tib fib and everything was hanging out the inside of my leg. In, the, then, bo in the boot? In the boot. It, it went through the boot. Oh, my God. And then, uh, then it, uh, I broke my talus in half which is like the main fucking part of your ankle to get all your mobility. Uh huh. And uh, I was sitting there laying on the ground and I, I think it's, dude, everyone always That one trips. took you a while, huh? Everyone always trips like, how come like we see you break bones but you're never screaming or you're never like, ah, fuck, it hurts. Like I just, I always sit there on the ground and I think I'm like, all right, I'm like, fuck, my legs broke, my fucking right heel's burning. I'm like, the doctor came up, he's like, what hurts? I go, I go, I feel something warm really fucking warm running down my leg i go i think i compound my tip fib i go i think my ankle's done you know what i mean uh, it was amazing thanks for coming on the show today jeremy it took me a i've been trying to come at you for a long time like you said i just got a phone and, and then you've been traveling the world and shit <laughs> but i'm dying to get you in and talk to you for a minute man i respect the shit out of you, Thank you. as an athlete and a, and a good friend and uh i wish you all that all the luck and and um let you get the fuck out of here and what, what do i follow you on if i if i'm a instagram twitch this one twitch this one yep for instagram and twitter or are you done with twitter just twitch this Twitch yeah, this. I just tag everything from my Instagram to it. <laughs> Same with me. <laughs> Instagram's for dummies that just want to see pictures. I can't read, so I don't go well, on Twitter. Well, pictures say a million things, too. Yeah, I'd, I'd rather look at Instagram yeah. and pictures and fuck Twitter. I can't. Yeah. I don't read anyways. 
Um, shout out to Susie, his wife. Oh, we wanted you to come in today, Susie. Thanks for uh, hooking this up. I actually got a hold of you to make it happen. But uh, <laughs> you're a fucking legend, man. And um, yeah, man, good luck with everything. It was good, ha good having you on the show.